There we go, the stream has actually started. Stream should be showing up correctly. Ah, crap, I didn't compensate for chat. Hello, and, and welcome to... to me on, on stream. <laughs> this will totally not go wrong in any way. I promise, he says. Shuffle's cutlery. I have cutlery. I have command. As well as cutlery. The cutlery is for command. In case it wasn't um. There we go. There we go. Got the channel. Okay, so we're going to be playing through the main campaign, uh, a couple of the bonus maps because I'm pro, and uh, eating a kebab. Good morning and welcome to session 999 of your Aperture Science Enrichment Center Automated Testing Confinement. I've done this You should before. be feeling rested and refreshed after your forced hibernation period. As you rested, our patent-damaging and toxins have slowly worn away at your brain's recently connected neurons, making any fears or anxieties you might have from the horror and or agony of what you have previously experienced melt away into a viscous fluid which now resides in your upper spinal cord. Pardon on the interruption. You probably don't remember much due to the brain chemicals. But a certain test subject managed to trigger a self-destruct sequence and destroy a large section of the facility. There's no need to worry. Testing will resume. Let's get back to the tedious informational nonsense. The remaining bodily fluids should be captured and immediately sent for analysis. Please pick up the handheld portal device to proceed. Um, any remaining and immediately sent for analysis conjures some pretty bad images in my mind. We're just gonna, we're just gonna keep on trucking. Keep on trucking. I. I, I did say there would be a kebab. It's a Friday. Those are the rules. Good. You appear to have a basic understanding of how portals can move you through space. Please continue to the next area. I open the doors. That was weird. Um, uh, unfortunately, the only downside to this kebab... Left, you will see a critical mass energy pellet. Please use your handheld portal device to direct the energy pellet into the high concentration electron dispersal unit. Excellent. The energy produced by this pellet extractor will be sent to a worthy cause, namely the elevator to the next chamber. Remember, you have approximately 43 hours to complete these tests before the symptoms of dehydration start to kick in. Ah, we've still got the slight video stutter thing, but it's, um, it's watchable, so. If it get, if it does get too bad, tell me, and I will bug people until they tell me how to fix it. Please place the weighted storage cube into the 1500 megawatt hydromagnetic cube stability unit. This will allow you to change the path of the energy pellet. I'm kind of pro with this, I like to think. A not. Note that any energy pellet will be destroyed if it comes in contact with the wrong side of a high magnetic beam stability unit. Uh. All right. to understand the nature of the weighted storage cubes and how they can deflect the energy pellets. 
Destroying the weighted storage cubes is often required for these tests, and you will not lose points based on how many millions of dollars worth of weighted storage cube technology you destroy. Right. Please do not approach the 1600 megawatt positive energy orb. The positron radiation can cause brain hemorrhages, retinal boiling, internal microwave syndrome, monitoring explosions, and eventually death. Minor lung explosions. What the fuck is a minor lung explosion? It's your lung explosion. If you experience any of the symptoms mentioned previously, then good news, you probably won't need to worry about dehydration. Probably. Just probably. That's so comforting. Oh, come on, say something. I can't be witty by myself. You know that. Can I be half witty? Do you remember these? Due to all those brain chemicals we pumped into your, um, brain, you will probably have a difficult time recollecting I want them to ramble, what yes. makes the green energy pellet special. The green energy pellets are different in that they have a half-life of 3.25428 million years. In other words, their lifetime is longer than yours by 3.25427 million years, or until you remove pressure from the... Thanks for the insightful facts, Wikipedia. I was going to let her figure it out on her own. Fantastic. Please continue to the chamber exit. Yeah, I am. Um, I figured you'd be a little amused by that. You've heard it before, but kind of. This chamber will test what you have learned so far. Remember, green energy pellets will last indefinitely without outside intervention. Congratulations. You have proven that you can solve puzzles at a third grade level. Please proceed to the exit. That's American third grade. Do we have any Americans Please in the chat? The truth, you know. This test was designed for children. Most test subjects peak at around 14 years of age, but you were still able to do it after several more years of brain deterioration and joint decay. This isn't a completely normal test run. The point of these tests is to restore power to the power sections of the facility. You should keep in mind, however, that you are simply helping me undo your massive failure. This test chamber, if needed, will restore power to the advertised media. Those children were probably animals by now, and probably not so long. I patiently awaited their alternative further inoculations. I want to make sure I'm not hitting somewhere ridiculously difficult to hit. There we go. Whoop. 
Congratulations on completing this test. This single energy pellet will power the Aperture Science Pediatric Wing for five days. The sick children would thank you if they could see. That's me double checking that my chewing isn't within OBS's listening range. Uh, it's not, so you won't be able to hear me chewing. That's a good thing. It won't piss you off. Please direct the energy pellet through the aperture science radiated flux rectangle. experience a mild tingling sensation while passing through the radiated flux rectangle. It's probably just your imagination. Or possibly the radiation. Or possibly the radiation. It's not guaranteed. Oh, shit. Enjoy the gratification while it lasts. It, it won't, won't last long. long. Oh no, the gratification from this test lasted a good 30, 30 seconds. And that was the third time I solved it. Yeah. This test chamber is meant to measure your mind's capacity for object persistence. In other words, this chamber will test your ability to understand that energy helps exist even when you cannot see them. We're learning here is that I timed that really poorly and I should have done this first. Should go. To be fair, none of that is really fantastic. You appear to understand that objects continue to exist even when they leave your field of vision. Great job. This encouragement core is really starting to get on my nerves. I'd like to point out, I don't think it's canonically called the imaginization. The imagination realizer. I don't think it's canonically called that. So that's not Mateusz is bad at naming things. That's the community is bad at naming things. Mathematical processing unit activated. Let's see. 15 million jobs divided by 15. Carry this to the To make this chamber the we will need to get the energy added to this. This test chamber took 9999 milliseconds. Complete. Fantastic job. Magnetical processing unit deactivated. 
Yes. Really fantastic work. <laughs> I love doing that! <laughs> Just to screw with them a little. Oh shit. Oh, okay then. I mean, don't get me wrong, it does sound nice. You will need to obtain the upgraded device in order to proceed to the exit Yes, yes, we know. She needs to control two portals for the later chambers. Okay, here's where I actually start to struggle to remember these, even though I can do this level in my no, seriously? Okay, maybe not seriously. I haven't sleep or played this level, but I have the potential capability to, so give me bonus points for that. Right? Considering I just solved it. There, there. There. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We're going to be revisiting that level later, but for personal reasons more than anything else. Did you know, when an energy pellet passes through a portal, its lifespan is increased to a minimum of six seconds? It's true. It took you long enough to get here. And don't use the eye more than two portal six cubes. But nonsense. Your root imagery, brute force tactics, and barbaric approach to problem solving seem to be doing the job just fine. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's not that funny. <laughs> okay, it is kind of that funny, but these hells. Fun fact you will not be able to complete this chamber without the use of your parietal lobe. Luckily, we have left it intact for just such an occasion. There's actually two puzzles to solve here. Well, three puzzles, but two direct puzzles and one subtle puzzle that I actually kind of like because I'm weird. Back because I know it's going to take longer to go. Back on that. If you look up there, there's a blue field. If I can't see the blue field, this happens. You found a cake! Are you really going to eat that? It's been sitting on the floor for who knows how long. Not to mention you almost stepped on it.
There's just one catch. I think I may now actually be trapped inside this test chamber. Um. Shit. <laughs> I may. Uh, yeah. Um. Yeah. Yeah, this test chamber is now no longer completable. I, I, I'm up. Fortunately, it reloads to you. We would like to take this opportunity to thank you for choosing Aperture Science. We know you have a choice of automated testing administrators, and we are glad you chose us. You have helped make Aperture Science the only private company in the world with a 100% employee retention rate. Thank you. 100%! Uncaught file not found exception. Congratulatory speech file number 037 does not exist. Please instruct the test subject to congratulate itself, and then proceed to the chamber exit. Itself? And 37 is my you lucky number. You've got to be kidding me. I mean, it's prime, and it's consistent across all my model parts. During the previous test, our remote brain scanners detected thought patterns consistent with indecent animalistic desires. Please refrain from attempting intercourse with any of the testing elements to know how it will eliminate, as it will distract from the testing procedure. This is what I get for hosting the YouTube livestream on my internal HDD. Ah, which one of you idiots was being salacious? Because god damn it. This is what I get for trying to reduce the amount of computing hardware I need by hosting bits of the stream on myself. Oh shit. We appreciate the amount of restraint and self-control you have shown in this test chamber. While many of the testing elements have the ability to copulate with humans, only a select few will actually produce some spread. And even the ones that won't will work with me. Oh, no, 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 no,
There's a secret in this chamber as well, but I cannot be asked to go through the complex procedure required to get it. So, F that shit. You are in very, very well for a test subject who has been given a rating of 17 stupid at units. Good job. Only 17. Okay, because that will technically solve the puzzle, just not quite as rapidly as I intended. Insert hometown. Insert that kid. Is my chat actually updating, or are you simply not saying anything? Because, um, my chat might be broken again. Knowing me, it probably is. <laughs> but I want to be certain, so... Reopens chat. And those planes taking too long. Can't find out right now if it is anywhere. Um... I'm pretty sure your stream's lagging. If you have a history of seizures or epilepsy, please refrain from looking at or standing near the hydromagnetic cube stability units. If you do not have a history of seizures or epilepsy, then you are in for a treat. Uh, for the record, uh, Matt outsourced them to itch.io, so they're no longer outright just downloadable. Well, they're, they're no longer just outright on his, uh... On his uh, web page, you have to actually uh, crack open. Uh, you have to actually crack open itch, which um, I was like, eh. So it means they're downloadable. I've got them on my computer somewhere, but getting OBS to actively record flash games that I don't have installed, mm, don't have like on the computer, is like pain in the ass and not in the good way. It's okay. I'm not exactly at the end, but I'm near the end. This is chamber 15 of, um, like what? 19? And I can do the rest of these pretty damn quick, so if I cut the... Ah. So I fucked up in two different ways there simultaneously. That one's correct. This one's incorrect. So if I go over to here, this should work and not kill me. Okay, so it did kill me, but that's because I really screwed up there. Oh shit. And now I've really screwed up, but differently! And I will not die! So it's fine, he says. It's not fine, but it's fine! I shall join them for car. Expediently. I would have noticed if you'd pinged- I, 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 I can lie to you and say I would have noticed if you'd pinged me, but I wouldn't have because I've muted Discord entirely. Remember to use proper elevator etiquette. 
Stand in the elevator with your arms at your sides and stare at the Aperture Science logo. Do not fire the handheld device inside the elevator. Um, do not lie. You've missed most of this. Or attempt to locate the hidden camera inside the elevator. Like the majority. Do not undress inside the elevator. Do not attempt to pry open the elevator door. No matter. And uh, I will be ending this pretty quickly because some friends of mine are playing car. And god damn it, I am going to go play car with them. Because it is car. Welcome to the difficult test. Yes, I have friends. Please use caution when attempting to solve the following tests and setting a prompt to order them when attempting. Number four C. They are truly that difficult, but then again, when you have a rating of 17 stupid to units, so yes, you might have some trouble. Okay. This one I can remember enough to solve it, but I can't guarantee I'll be able to solve it quickly just because of the maneuvers. So. Uh, that's phase one. Phase two does not get any easier. On. Come on, man. Duck. Mysterious surprise at ninety nine point nine nine eight five percent activation energy. Uh, if it makes you feel any better, uh, I posted a link to this live stream in the link section of Sam's server. So if you want, I can ping you when I do that. You explicitly. This chamber is even easier than the last one. Oh shit! This Just one. Follow Seventeen the and Oh wait, the yeah, arrows have... haven't been installed yet. Shit! Well, Just be better at solving tests then. Uh, move, move, move. Jump to here. Around and through here, and this will open. And ha! Mysterious surprise at 99. Now the intent was for me to ramble on this. Activation energy. I did this for Anti, and um, Anti hasn't said that much. Uh, so I don't know if I'm actually being helpful here or not. But yeah. Uh, if you want me to actively ping you specifically when I start streaming, I could do that. This repetition oh, is making me want to murder something. Anyway, here's the next test chamber. Enjoy. Oh fuck, it's this test. I hate this test. Like, this is one of those tests that pretends to be easy, and then fucking bites you in the ass.
No. Damn it, I might have screwed up. Ah. I'm in first time not dead yet. Oh, right, I'm dumb. No, 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 this is easy. Oh, for God's sakes! How do you f that up? Okay, there we go. Oh, what the <laughs> Welcome to LT Screws Up in New and Inventive Way. Uh, there'll be a lot of them, because they've put all 146 back up, remember? Make that go past... Bing. Bong! Mysterious surprise at 99.9% Okay! 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 Energy. Should be able to finish this. A million monkeys at a million typewriters who might be able to recreate the works of Shakespeare, yeah, but it's hard to imagine one monkey is solving this final death chamber. Mysterious surprise at 100% activation. Now, if you time this just right, and you don't have a half a kebab box on your desk. Energy. Please proceed to the exit elevator. You can. You don't have half a kebab box on your desk and. Really? Greasy fingers, you can do that. And the game is now over. So I'm gonna stop this stream.